वेलकम फ्रेंड्स सो येट इन येट अनादर वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग सेशन वी सॉ दिस क्वेश्चन टूडे एंड मोस्ट ऑफ यू हैव आंसर ट्राई टू आंसर इट एंड फ्यू ऑफ यू हैव टेकन अ रॉन्ग अप्रोच ऑल टूगेदर मोस्ट ऑफ यू हैव अज्यूम्ड रॉन्ग थिंग्स एंड देन दे यू हैव ट्राई टू अटेम्प्ट दिस प्रॉब्लम बट नाउ लेट एस अंडरस्टैंड वट दिस प्रॉब्लम वॉज एंड वट शुड बी द थिंकिंग प्रोसेस so the question was that one inch squares are cut from the corners of this 5 inch square so this was 5 inch square and one inch corner was cut out from the square and you have to find out the area in square inches of the largest square that can be fitted into the remaining space most of you have done this that you have considered efgh as the largest square that could be fitted into this remaining space but you didn't think of another square which could be of this type a b c d most of you have also taken uh, another assumption where you have uh, joined these these points the midpoints and considered this to be the this to be the uh, the requisite square but it's not the case so uh, why because in that case if you join the midpoint there will there will still be some space left between the corners of the smaller square i'll i'll show you what I, what do i mean let us say if you are joining joining the midpoints and let us say this was was this is all 1 inch this 1 inch square so if you join the midpoints like that don't go by the accuracy of the diagram what i'm trying to say is there will be some space left over here so hence the the and hence if you see this is the you are limiting the size of the square now if you could have brought this uh line which is highlighted here closer to the closer to the closer to this vertex this this corner vertex so that they are in 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 contact then you can actually maximize the square so hence but if you increase the size then the square would just go out of the space isn't it if you if you try to let's say let us say this is the line and you try to move this in this direction then the square would be like that and then it would go out of the remaining space so hence in that case what you need to do is you need to rotate this and hence once you rotate it this particular vertex these vertices will now come and fit in into the remaining space and if you see this is how the final figure would look like like this correct so this would be the uh the largest area of the square now uh what are these smaller lengths we don't know but we actually don't require also to find it out to find the find this area so what will be this area like so very clearly you can see the area is nothing but area of area of square abcd is nothing but area of square efgh efgh plus the area of four triangles what triangles area of triangle a a e h plus area of triangle triangle d h g and plus area of triangle c g f plus area of triangle plus area of triangle b f e is it now in all these if you notice due to symmetry all are equal in area and not only because of symmetry you can see that the base of all these triangles are same right so for example in this case a e h h e is the base so you can see h e is the base then uh, in triangle d h g h g is the base and c g f g f is the base and your e b f or b f e uh, e f is the base and all these bases are equal right h because all these are equal because all of them are nothing but 5 minus 1 minus 1 why this 5 and then you take this one off take this one off so what is it 3 inches is it it all are 3 inches long and the height height of all these triangles also if you see what is the height here if i have to mention the height this is the height isn't it in this case this is the height in this case this is the height in this case and this is the height in this case which is nothing but the distance between the two parallel lines right so hence what is the height clearly the height height of all these height is nothing but 1 inch 1 inch why because this line is equal to this side 
isn't it because if you can see notice this is a rectangle so hence this ae will be equal to sorry not ae this this height is equal to uh, let us say let me highlight this so this height is equal to this side or this height is equal to this height like that right so hence all the triangles will have the same base and same height now can we not find out the area then yes of course we can find out so what is the area so area of square efgh is nothing but 3 square 3 into 3 because efgh ef this is 3 and this also is 3 so area of the square is 3 square plus what is the area of total sum of all the areas of the triangle will be nothing but 4 into why 4 into because all the areas have sorry all the triangles have same base and same height so half into base is 3 into height is 1 right so hence it is 6 so 9 plus 6 is equal to 15 square inch so this is the solution so answer to this problem is that the area is 15 square inch Okay, so in this case, answer is C.